to my YouTube channel. If today is your first time of stopping bell, please don't forget to subscribe and hit the notification bell so that anytime we uploaded a new video, you will be forced to watch. So, in today's video, we are going to be preparing a spinach. We are going to be preparing spinach soup. Let's go there. I'm going to be showing you guys my ingredients for this preparation. Yes, so, so guys, here is it. Here is my goat's meat that I'm going to be using. Here is my cow leg as well. I just boiled it already. I cooked them already. I'm going to be removing it from the bone. I'm going to be separating the cow leg, the cow skin from the bones. And here is my beef meat. Here is my fish that I'm going to be using. My turkey and my chicken and my bear peppers as well. I'm going to be using these two bear pepper as well. My spinach, as you can see it. Here is my oil that I'm going to be using. Here is my onion. And here is my akboroko fish, <laughs> my stock fish. That I'm going to be using my mangi cube and salt that I'm going to be using for this recipe. My time for boiling the meat. Okay, let's get started. Okay. So here is my goat meat. I wash everything properly. And right now I'm going to add it to the water I used to boil the cow leg before. Okay. Now I'm going to add my seasoning cube and the thyme, curry and salt. I'm going to add everything together. To cook let's leave it for about 20 to 30 minutes to cook and at this moment I'm adding my onion as well so after 20 minutes I'll be adding my beef meat later let's go guys right now I just added my beef meat and the turkey and chicken because uh, the goat meat have already done already i'm adding those things to it so that everything will cook together the goat meat have almost done so let's cover it let me add some fire to it so that everything will cook together at once. You can see my fish. I wash everything very well. I wash it properly. You see? It's very clean. So now I'm going to be blending my, my bell pepper and onion together. So here is my bell pepper. With the onion, I'm going to be blending it right away. Okay. Let me prolong it and blend. The meat is still cooking. Let's check our meat. It's almost done. 
the heat is too much you guys cannot see it very well guys my spinach is like this and i'm going to be slicing it again they have sliced it before i have to slice it again to a smaller pieces let's go there okay the first thing that we are going to be doing right now is adding i just add my oh yeah my vegetable oil to the pot here is my vegetable oil the next thing we are adding right now is my onion okay let's leave it like five minutes so after that we are adding our blended pepper and onion we blend it before together yes here is our meat uh, water we used to boil the meat before okay let's leave it to cook so after five minutes we are adding our tomato paste to it i just made this tomato paste myself i blend it yesterday and then i boiled it down okay you can see it now the way is red with that tomato paste that I just added to it. this so right now I will be adding my crayfish after the crayfish my mangy cube as well After this, let's cover it again for 10 minutes to cook. You can see this. This is my stock fish. I just boiled them. I'm going to wash them right away. So after like 15 minutes, this is my stew, my sauce. Spinach. So let's add our meat to it. Here is everything. My fish. I like to fry them a little bit. The turkey and the goat's meat and the beef meat. First of all, let's add the beef meat and the goat's meat to it. After that, we are adding our turkey meat to it. To the heat of it, we will not let you guys see it very well. The smoke that coming out from this sauce. okay after that let's leave it a little bit to cook again let's cover it okay okay that we are adding our cow skin to it and turn everything together after 
added the cow skin just add your act boroko to it that is a uh, we call it melusa is it melusa i don't know <laughs> i don't remember <laughs> stockfish <laughs> this way okay let's cover it again for like five minutes so guys let's remember the water we used to boil our meat we are going to filter it and remove all the nyama nyama out of it so let's do that together yes i just did you can see that so here's the clean water so right now we are going to add the water to it the water we used to boil the meat before so we will not leave it like five minutes again so now let's add our fish to it you can see the fish i love to fry everything and turn it together okay and cover it again for two minutes or three minutes so after a few minutes we are going to be removing the fish so that it will not scatter this side our soup right now we are adding the may the may thing our spinach to it yes so and what turn everything together again So after a few minutes you can see our spinach and right now we are adding what are we adding last is our fish that we removed before so our soup is ready our spinach is ready guys if you love the way i prepare this spinach soup eh? don't forget to like this video share it hmm? Share it with your loved ones so so that they can also cook the spinach soup this way. Don't mind the noise though. It's my boy that is telling you guys that my mom is not alone. I'm here helping her. So here is the final of my spinach soup. See that? Thank you all for watching. Bye bye.